Hey there, beautiful earth. No, air signs. Oh, hang on. Have you got an earth sign in your life? Air sign? Maybe you do. I don't know. Sometimes when I have these Freudian slips, it's because <laughs> there's something behind it. Hmm. Okay, some of you have got headaches here. Some of you have got stress. Some of you aren't drinking enough water straight away. Okay. Work stress. The need to take a break from work, I'm feeling. Ooh. All right, the cards are ready now. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for spending your time with me. This is your love reading and we're going to look at the person you're thinking about. Then we're going to take a look at your energy and see how the energies come together for this love reading. Okay, I was mentioning an earth sign so <laughs> here, here they are. This is an earth sign. <laughs> this is someone you truly find grounding for you in your life this person you feel like you know can be your healer or someone who you can um, feel comfortable around you know it's kind of like that feeling if you hopped into a bathtub and it's nice and warm and you go oh and your muscles relax you know I feel like you speak to this person either on, you know, some sort of social media platform or perhaps, you know, you message or call one another. I'm feeling that very strongly. I'm also feeling like this person can be off balance sometimes. Perhaps they've had an ear issue. Perhaps they're getting dizzy. Perhaps they're getting... Um, I don't know let's take a look at their energy it looks like they've had a, a bit of burden in the past and it looks like they're trying to uh, take or you know relax their mental confusion or um, I don't know like for some of them it feels as if they could have been taking some kind of medication that makes them drowsy or kind of um, or just overthinking in general you know but this is a past energy I feel like they're overthinking take it how it resonates you know the energies might also be flipped in this particular reading you seem to be a little off balance yourself <laughs> unfortunately just a little bit you know kind of like oh which way do I go especially with relation to business and it's like you want to take a pause for healing and the universe is saying you know what you really need to take a pause you need to stop rushing around for work this is more like a a bit of a health reading rather than a love reading but so the energies together is is like it's it's you know because of all this stuff going on in the in the karmic world in the you know in the 3d reality it feels disjointed the love that you could be having with this other person feels disjointed and it looks like you know one of you is kind of contemplating your feelings on the matter and the other one seems a little bit confused in general life in general it's like you're both kind of just trying to get through this period that you're going through. But your counterpart, you know, is stable, is grounded, is coming through as, you know, taking care of themselves, being healthy. You know, has a beautiful, serene kind of energy. It could be the mother of your children because underneath that, we have... <laughs> I call it the who's your daddy card so we have mummy and daddy here so perhaps this is someone you want to have children with or perhaps you do have children with um, 
but the male energy whoever that is whoever the male energy seems to be a little bit ungrounded having a few issues you know because they're working on their finances you know I kind of feel like they have to you know it's like they've got a sword and they're trying to you know if you're thinking back in the olden days um, you know they're kind of walking through a jungle and they're slashing their way <laughs> it's funny I'm saying that because this comes up it's like they're slashing their way through to get to the next part let's just get through this week <laughs> so that, you know let's just speak our truth or do what we need to do you know perhaps we're getting pissed off a little bit quickly the other person or maybe this is you but you know it's like you just want to get through this week <laughs> you know there's not much wish fulfillment here in terms of love because there's just so much that you've got to think about that's really not related to love it's more related to work or overthinking or just getting stuff done so hopefully the weekend becomes a little bit clearer let's get some love messages from your counterpart see what they want to say to you considering we haven't seen much love come about yet it's like you're just both trying to get through right now okay all right so if they've been a little bit in their ego they say I'm truly sorry for my words and actions they also say I get butterflies every time my eyes lock with yours <laughs> Wow, they also say I'm thinking about you right now. And if they've gone away for a little time to either work on themselves or get this work done, it seems like they've got work, work, work to do. Just because I let you go doesn't mean I wanted to. Okay, so if they're not coming in, if they're not texting, calling, you know, spending time with you, it's, it's not because they don't want to, it's just because they've got some stuff going on right now. And it's funny, you know, in my, <laughs> I've got a, an Australian $5 bill here or a $5 note. And this usually comes out when there's a need for change. You know, five represents change. And it's like they want to change the way they're behaving because they know that, you know, this overworking kind of takes away from, not only from the way they feel, but they just need to chill more so that they can relax and enjoy their life and that means they could do that with you too if they had more time on their hands wow earth uh i don't know why i keep saying earth sign air sign this is an air sign reading they must be an earth sign <laughs> wow this won't resonate for all of you but i think for those of you that have an earth sign they say and you're not going to believe this I know you are my twin flame wow I feel breathless when we communicate in a good way <laughs> they also say I often dream of making love to you <laughs> and they also say can I call you sweetheart that's what I feel like saying wow so some fresh nice energy here this is great energy uh a little bit of overthinking though going on um the need to just chill out a little bit i feel for both of you um you know because if if there's i don't know what's that saying all work and no play makes jack a dull boy I don't know why that's coming up. Maybe someone's counterpart or other half or person that you're thinking about is called Jack. Or maybe that name is important to you. Perhaps a past loved one that you know is called Jack and they're watching over you. That could also be true. Um, I don't know why. I don't know why. Jack, that name is important for this reading. So tell me if it resonates in the comments below. 
I just want to get a little love message from your person now. Because I feel like they want to say something. Here we go. Yeah. I'm trying to get my my luck and my money together. I'm trying to transform my life. You know, it, I'm getting it in a very monetary way. Not only in a mon monetary way, but also in a... Um, Uh, a study kind of way like they might be studying something they might be learning a new religion they might be um, practicing some sort of religious or cultural thing gaining some knowledge that way uh, because they feel that there's injustice in the world and so they believe that this spiritual practice or religious practice or new study thing that they're doing will help perhaps the world or perhaps themselves in some way okay one last quick message here <laughs> we don't need to say any more than that this for me is often a twin flame card and uh, this is someone who wants to give you their love on an equal balance in an equal and balanced way you know, they want to give it to you in a nurturing way, in a loving way, in a healing way. They want to make you feel good. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, air signs. This is definitely the air sign reading. If I said earth sign, it's because some of you are thinking about an earth sign. <laughs> so take it all how it resonates for you and I hope it was helpful. Someone knows a Jack. Hmm. <laughs> I'm also getting that movie, uh, Titanic, where... Um, you know the main character is Jack so take that how it resonates for you the main character is Jack okay have a beautiful day night afternoon or evening or morning wherever you are in the world and I'll see you real soon bye